Hey gang, why don't you join me today for an excellent chest and tricep workout. Plus, today's the day I officially kick off my bench press project. So stick around for a little while with me. I'll show you the workout and tell you what this bench press project is all about. Let's go do it. Hey gang, welcome back to Mark 60 Plus Fitness Journey. Today is Saturday, September 3rd, 2022. And it is a chest and triceps day. In addition to that, it is also the official kickoff of my bench press project. I have a deadlift project, a squat project, and now a bench press project. And I am kicking that off today. I will leave links to the deadlift project or the latest videos of the deadlift project and the squat project down in the description and up here in the corner for your perusal and viewing pleasure at your leisure. So, uh, as I said, today is chest and triceps day. So uh, let me quit yapping and get to that. And while we're there, I'll talk a little bit more about this bench press project, the goal, and maybe a little bit about how I'm going to get to that goal. So let's get to the gym and do this workout. Okay, so as I mentioned, today is indeed a chest and tricep workout. And while I'm warming up here, I'm starting off with bench press today, and you'll see why in a bit. But as I'm warming up here, I want to talk about uh, my bench press project that I alluded to earlier. That officially kicked off today with today's chest and tricep workout. And if you've been uh, following me recently, you may know that I have set some goals I want to attain before the end of this year, 2022, or before I turn 63. And here's a quick little view of those goals. So, as you see there, these are the numbers of the squat and bench press and deadlift, and including pull-ups and push-ups, that I want to be able to do by the end of this year, or before I turn 63. And among them, you will see squat 350, deadlift 440, and bench press 280. So that is my bench press project. And uh, I am now officially on the quest to do a 280 pound bench press before the end of this year. And ultimately into next year, I want to cross over the 300 pound threshold. Okay, even though today is the official kickoff of the bench press project, this is actually session three of my recent restart of bench pressing after about a year off. Um, session one was three sets of five reps at 185 for the main body of work. Session two was three sets of five reps at 195 for the main body of the bench press work. And today I'm gonna do three sets of five reps at 205. Now, I am feeling really stoked about this. This, uh, although it's only been three sessions, I'm feeling strong. It's, uh, I feel like the bench press is coming back really well. Um, I may have started overly cautious at 185 for session one, but that's okay. I have to be careful. I believe I mentioned uh, last year this time, or a little longer than that, I had a little t uh, pec tear on the right side of my chest. So I'm being overly cautious with this. Um, so I, you know, I felt good with this this three set effort here. Uh, like I said, I did a lot of warm ups, and uh, so I was ready. And you can see I use a little wider grip than a lot of folks do, but that's the way I've always done it, and it works well for me. But that three sets of five was easy. Uh, could have uh, certainly done a little bit more there, and um, as such, I figured I'd test myself a little bit and just do one little one little test at 215, see how many reps I could get there comfortably. Uh, on session one, I actually did a single at 225 fairly easily for me. Um, this, I did 
uh, three reps here, and I, I honestly believe I could have gotten five out of this, but just want to be careful with that uh, pec muscle on the right, right side. So, Okay, so continuing on with the rest of today's chest workout, I'm going to continue with a theme I've been following for the last couple of weeks or so, and that is less volume. Maybe a little heavier work, lower reps, and less volume. Just less work than what I was doing. And I believe, uh, you know, I, I may have been overworking myself to the point that I wasn't uh, giving myself enough recuperation and rest time, so I'm trying to remedy that. Plus, I think this is going to help me reach my goals for the end of the year. And say, for example, the bench press goal of 280. I want to uh, kind of work more on strength than hypertrophy right now to get to that goal. But uh, I did uh, three sets on this incline uh, machine press. And, the, and again, I was feeling pretty stoked too because this is, is the same weight I was using earlier, you know, a couple of weeks ago when I started, used to start my workout with these incline presses. So that's a good sign. Um, and, you know, after the bench press workout, I was able to pretty much do the same work I did before, same weight anyway. And this last, this last set was one truly to failure. I uh, got to the point where I tried, I don't know what rep this was, six or seven at the end there, but it just wouldn't go. But it was a good three sets, so felt good. So that's six sets of chest work for the moment. Um, so I'm going to move into some tricep work here. And this is something new, haven't done before. This is a like a cable overhead tricep extension using a straight bar rather than the ropes. Um, and I'll have to tell you, I didn't like it. Uh, I did it. I did three sets. I'll see what it feels like tomorrow if there's any oddball soreness in, in, in good places or bad. And, but uh, I think next time I do these, I'll go with the old standby ropes. I think it gives the triceps a little better range of motion. I like that straight bar for tricep push downs on the cables. And again, uh, going to my, uh, I did three sets of these um, kickbacks. And I did another experiment today. Normally I have that pulley up higher, like hip height. Uh, today I said, well, let's try it down low and see what happens. Um, yeah, you know, worked all right. I felt it. I felt it where I wanted to, but uh, I didn't feel as comfortable. Um, and you'll see this right here. It looks like I'm not getting a full extension on my arm. Uh, it may or may not matter that much because I did feel it. I felt it pretty good. I mean, I, I got a nice uh, outer tricep head pump going there. And, you know, so, but I think there again, I'm going to go back to the way I was doing it with the pulley up about hip height. Those tricep kickbacks, I love them. Some folks don't get much out of it, I hear, but I love those. And again, <laughs> something else new today. I'm doing a single arm tricep extension using a rope. Um, I wasn't expecting much with this, but I was pleasantly surprised with this. This felt great. It's uh, kind of an isol well, I guess it is an isolation movement, but I've got to remember this one because it was sweet. Got a lot of work out of this. Uh, again, three sets here of tricep work with this single arm cable tricep extension. So that's a total of nine sets of tricep work, and most of it was in the you know, 10 to 12 rep range to near failure. Felt pretty good. So I wanted to finish up today. I wanted to get three more good sets of chest work. Um, so again, if you know me, I like to do push-ups and uh, in general, but I like to do them at the end of a workout as a finishing movement, you know, when you're pre-exhausted, plus the triceps are pretty, pretty spent by this time too. So uh, this first set, I did a max out to failure. That's what this is. I think I got 30, five or 36 but again i did this to failure i tried the last one it just didn't go as you will see in a moment but i did three sets of, of these to failure uh, i think i got a total of 63 64 i don't know something like that but it was a great workout 
I felt good with the bench press workout. And I think today's official kickoff went well. And I believe 280 pound bench press by the end of this year is infinitely doable. So thank you, thank you so very much for hanging out with me today. I surely appreciate it. Alrighty, there you go. Today's chest and triceps workout for September 3rd, 2022. Uh, pretty good one. Lower volume, sticking with the lower volume. A little heavier weight, a little less work. I think it's working out, and in particular, I think it's gonna work out well for these projects I'm working on, which involve heavy singles. Um, so 300 pounds 300 pound bench press before the end of this year 2022 or before i turn 63 i think it's doable i'm feeling solid and good about this one not feeling so good about my squat uh project and goal there but I'm gonna press on keep that number the same but the bench press after today's workout i feel pretty solid about that um anyway it's a good workout Thank you so very much for being here and hanging out with me. I always say this and I always mean it. I surely do appreciate it. So if you would, do me the kindness of hitting that like button. And if you haven't already, click that subscribe button. Come join us. Love to have you here. And uh, I guess with that, I'll just wish everyone an excellent day, an excellent week, and an excellent month. And I hope you're having some great workouts. And with that, I will say, until next time, go get them. Mark out.